Hi. Uh, I keep messing with... I keep messing with OBS. There's so... Everything's so fiddly these days. Um, oh, I can put on... I haven't been doing this, have I? There. A little better, I guess. I also want to... Freaking autofocus. Mm -hmm. Now, there. Yeah, it's... Why? Um, I messed around with that at one point, and it... I couldn't figure out how to turn off autofocus. Uh, there's no manual focus. It's, it's just automatic. That's the thing I hate about technology these days. Everything is being automatic and I can't do anything about it. Anyway, uh, if I switch to gameplay, my audio gets like a little bit louder. Is that right? I've noticed that in the VODs. I've been Googling about it. Anyway, <laughs> if that's hugely distracting, then let me know, but... So I don't I don't switch between those very often. Anyway, we're playing Door Fortress. Uh, another chill Door Fortress day. Um, did a little bit more blueprinting off stream. Oh, way zoomed in. Uh, mostly, I say blueprinting. I just put it in as actual things. I, I'm looking at him like, is this what I, is this what I did? Um, this is what I did. Uh, there's this stuff. These are going to be temples. I want like one big temple here. Um, and then I put in some more of our guild halls. One thing that I looked up, I guess, probably not a revelation to some people, but guild halls are interesting uh, because the way skills break down, there's like, there's skills and then they go into categories. And I didn't realize that the broad categories make guild halls or make guilds. Which if I paid attention, I would have figured out. Uh, but like there, there's carpenter and woodcutter and, and, you know, bow maker. They can make their guilds, but they can also come together to make a, I don't know what it's called, a, a woodcrafter's build. A general wood guild. Um, and in fact, that's more commonly what you will get, because you need ten of a person with the same profession to come together to make a guild, or ten people in the same category profession. So statistically, you're probably going to have ten people in a category more than you have ten individual things. So most of the time you're going to get uh, these big category guilds to start with. And then later you're probably gonna like we'll probably get some of the smaller ones too the more specific ones um but if you just want to cover your bases there's only 11 categories of of professions so if you make yourself 11 guild halls and just designate them for the major profession groups um then all you have to deal with is the the extra ones that pop up that are more specific uh, so here we have space for 15 guilds, right? Uh, yes, 15. Because uh, I can count. Um, the other thing that I found out is that you can make a guild hall or a guild that isn't a guild yet. And that actually has a benefit. Um, because if you have, say, like two of a profession, they're not going to petition for a guild hall. But if you give them a guild hall, they can still do guild things there, just the two of them. Um, and that's good. Having a guild hall is more opportunities for people to gain skills and happy thoughts from gaining skills and thoughts from learning and so on and so forth. So, um, I am going to make a guild hall for each of the major 11 profession categories. And then I can't remember if we have, uh, I forget which guilds we have established. We only have two or three, I think. Uh, we got the Sepia Woods, which is a farmer guild hall, which I believe is one of the categories. Maybe I should, I should pull it up if I'm going to be talking authoritatively. Uh, guild. Uh, so, farmer guild. Yeah, so farmer guild has a... Oh, boy. No wonder. Uh, so, farmer guild is... Cheesemaker, milker, cook, thresher, 
butcher, tanner, dyer, planter, soap maker, beekeeper, presser, shearer, all those things go into farmer. Uh, so that's why we have we have 33 farmers because that's all those professions. So no wonder that one was requesting a grand guild hall. Makes sense. Uh, and then we have our crafts dwarf. So that's likewise a big one. Wood crafter, stone crafter, leather crafter, weaver, clother, glass maker, potter, glazer, strand extractor. All those go to all those go to crafts dwarf guild. And then our third one is the planter guild. See there, that one is a sub skill or not is a more specific profession than farmer. Farmer guild covers planter, but we also have nine. We probably guess we had ten at some point. We had ten planters specifically, so they will petition for their own specific guild hall. Um, and I think that's all of our established guilds at the moment. We're probably gonna get more. Um, let's paper. Just random crap laying around. Anyway. So yeah, we'll make one for each of the categories. And then we'll make one for planters, because that's what they want. And then from there, we just need to keep an eye out for new, more specific guilds. And people who request fancier guild halls. And that should be all we have to take care of. Yes. Um, so guild halls, that makes sense. The... Oh, why... Temples. This is really just a start to the temples, and we'll see if I change my mind on this anyway. Um, I like the grand one. I don't know if I like what I've done here. This might change. Um, temples are a little bit more uh, squirrely, I guess, than guilds. Obviously, there's no set number of gods or religions uh, that can happen, and there's no way you're going to make them for all of them, right? Uh, by, can I, I wonder if I can even look at them. Um, buttons, buttons. Where, where are we? Here, it's, it's this. Um, I think we can already see Nomination of whisperings is all yeah, so like we have one really big church. So like that's the other thing, is they're all gonna be different sizes. Hello, cat here. Um some are gonna need to be bigger than others. Some are gonna be like we're gonna have one big one for no specified deity, and then we're, we're gonna have to make a big one for um for these, the denomination of whispering. I think this is our only established religion. In our fortress. Everything else is just people worshiping gods. This is like an actual, an actual faith. Um, that's why we had to we had to sign a uh, an exalted veil. I wish I could see more about their religion from here. Um, like this, dedicated to Doran. It's just dedicated to a god. What are you there? Look and walk, trade the wayward. 23 worshippers, jeez. Um, only organized religions can have recognized priesthoods. Interesting. We only, we only have one organized religion. Currently. Um, so we'll want to give them a nice space. Um, maybe over here. And we'll do one like this and one like this. And then we'll do something down here for the, the smaller ones. We're gonna we're gonna leave that for now. <laughs> um, for the moment. Um, I also took a look at this. This was a little a little scuffed. Um, the thing that I need to remember is that if you designate a channel on one level, you don't want to designate the mining on the level below. Because that's what I had here. I had. Uh, because I want this, this is all going to get channeled, but this isn't. Um, 
So in the level above, I had all of this designated for channeling. Then I also have this designated for being mined, which is a redundant, but you don't need to do that. If you channel from above, then you have also mined out that same space. You just have also removed the ceiling um, and floor, I guess. Um, but you can get into weird situations, especially if they're like the same priority where someone can channel down and then dig over and then someone else channels and then now you have a cave collapse uh so that's that's how that's how that can happen um or things just get stuck like it doesn't seem to clear the the mining things now that there's nothing there to mine um, so it just kind of got all weird uh, we had a little abandoned i think that's what happened here uh, we channeled all this out and then someone came down here and dug and they removed all of the ramps that were giving access to here. So then all of a sudden people couldn't get back up to the top to finish the channeling because someone was mining out down below. I think that's what happened. Um, so we're just gonna, we're gonna do this the hard way. Uh, fortunately we have stairs here so we can get up still. Um, and then yeah, we're gonna mine out the, the side bits and then we're gonna remove the ramps. And then this is all going to get channeled, and this part we'll have to dig, but I'll, I'll designate that when we get down there. Um, but we only have one floor left. We're almost done with our, our great hall. Um, very happy about that. And yeah, I think that's all I've done off stream. Uh, who's, who's making sounds? Yeah, okay. Yeah, you're right, I'm missing phone calls. Okay. We also have this dwarf monster slayer corrupted stalker. Oh boy, Erish. Uh leave oh yeah more more cave fish people because always uh we're still working on draining our lake still making progress there's a lot of oh we're getting there it is so much water though um i had designated something over here yeah Probably to... No? No one can get here. That's the problem. This is all completely sequestered. Okay. So if we want a way across... We can come up... Get to here. Okay. Here. Jeez. Okay. Um, let's do this. I'm gonna make some passages over. More like this. Um. Okay. Why don't you have access to anything else? Because I need to open that gate. That makes sense. Let's, uh... We'll, we'll do that. But... At the same time... Let's make sure there's not a whole bunch of stuff hiding back there. Had this, I've had that door closed for quite a while now. Um, so we're going to take these guys and just come down here and make sure nothing weird happens. And we're all good there. Okay. How's your equipment doing? Am I disappointed? I'm disappointed. I don't understand. Maybe telling them to, to come down here might help. Let's see. Um, got all that stuff gone. Okay. 
other stuff. We're working on all of this. Getting pretty good. We're getting there. Like all I'm getting tables. Okay. Tables and chairs. Um their food. Gonna need to move some barrels down. Ghostly miner put to rest, thank you. Um You are constantly tantrum. Um, not good intellect, but poor focus. Find something humorous in everything, no matter how serious or inappropriate. After wearing old clothing in 107, you need to fix the clothing. Um, often inflamed by hatred and easily develops hatred toward things. A strengthening after seeing a great horned owl woman's dead body. You saw one body as a monster hunter. And it inflamed your hatred forever. Okay. Cracks easily under pressure after being caught in the rain. Tends to consider what others think of him after wearing tattered clothing. Yeah. Okay. Starting fist fight. You've been here since 103. You've been tantruming like the whole time. Be more prone to stress after learning and learn to disdain stoicism. Resentful dwelling upon seeing a great horned owl woman's body. Be more hateful and learn to value peace. Rage. Um, what else are you doing? Ashamed dwelling upon starting a fist fight. Angry dwelling upon getting into an argument. Ferocity relieving being attacked. Uh, speaking of disorderly conduct, yeah, I hope that one witness, I hope that was okay. Uh, oh, you're, I guess that's fine. Part of me is always like, you know, it's, it's definitely not convenient that people get into these tantrum traps and, and kind of sit in their misery for a little while, but look at all their, uh, <laughs> uh, their histories. Nine times out of ten, we're just in a trauma situation. Can't be that mad, I guess. I get it. I am going to enforce the rules, though. Cool. Uh, convicts. Many. Who has sentences pending? None of these. Okay. 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 You were... Maybe that's us. Does it connect? I don't... I don't know. How long were these people sitting under there? Or they're coming, they're coming out to grab things. I understand. Okay. Now... I'm like this. Uh, everything so far. I'll just do that. Then... Yeah. 
need that to be done before they can actually go and designate the others. Um, we got some friends down here. I was also trying to dig over here, wasn't I? Queen has mandated construction of goods. Might be our first demand. Make rings, make gauntlets. Oh no, she didn't demand rings already. Uh, gauntlets is fine though. Probably need more of those. Steel gauntlet. Almost to three of those and go. Oh. Make them cougar sized. The other thing I was thinking of, we have doors up here somewhere. Door. I want to have more doors. More doors. They can be made from whatever. That's fine. Use up some of our miscellaneous stone. Um, I thought I had designated something. Oh, here we are. This not happen. We can no ramps here. How does this work? I know these are. How do we get down here in the first place? There's a bunch of a bunch of stuff happening. That's for sure. Um, I'm just gonna make a stairwell. Uh, it's like three floors. Interesting. No access. Okay. Um, well, we could dig through here. How did we... we've been over there. Oh, that's confusing. Oh, shush. Um. um yeah, well, we'll let that go. and all our corpses. Well, that was the other thing I was going to do. Um, all the corpses, or all these, I guess, like I can just designate them to dump. What are you doing? Unreachable location. Oh, because we closed this. I always... Forget that I closed those doors. Um, but all these things that aren't important, all these just bones and stuff, I can just dump them directly. Um, like here, maybe I'll just forbid you. have to go to a stockpile first. I can just mark them for dumping. Yeah, let's do this. Just dump. For you. Well, I guess I just want you not dumped, not forbidden. And that's all fine. Then these. To wait to put them in our refuse stockpile. We just take them straight down to the incinerator, which is here. Hopefully. 
Oh, we got our... Yes, perfect. Um, so we can pull this again. Pull once. Now we have magma glass furnace. Hooray. So I need a spot to put the sand and also the glass. Need a ton of space for it. Um, and we're getting getting a little bit of bismuth eye. Gonna take a little bit. Um, have more found. That's where I've seen some in the walls. Anyway. Duck found dead. Oh, wait, there's another thing that I need to address. It's terrain. Oh, yeah. Um, okay. Yeah, they're probably just... Because they can cross. Yeah, they're only going down one level. Um, I am going to... Enable the mining on all of this because this is going to go down further than. Well. Actually, they should be fine. Uh, let's. Okay. Mace Dwarf first wrestler. Oh, they're falling? Okay. Champion versus administrator. Is this justice being meted out? Champion punches the administrator. First wrestler? That's not intentional. Planter versus militia captain. Still all grumpy. Um... Looking at all the slaughtering jobs, reminds me, control shift D. I was watching... Yes, scheming through the VOD, and I made a, I made a mistake with my numbers here. Um, and in my defense, I think I was told wrong. Maybe. Let's go over to Auto, auto Butcher here. Um, the order that the numbers are listed here seems different than the order that they're listed over here. So I, I flopped around the female and male bits. Um, yeah, because they have five female kids and five female adults, and one of each male. I wanted to do two of each male, but then I, I swapped them all. <laughs> so, let's do auto but. Nope. Auto butcher. Target. Yeah, so target here says female kids, male kids, female adults, male adults. And what is it here? Female kids, male kids, female adults, male adults. Where was I getting the other way around? Maybe I just flopped it in my head. That's also a thing that can happen. Uh, but ultimately, I want to set these targets to five female kids, two male adults, two male kids, five female adults, two male adults. Oh.
So yeah, okay. So now a pack has five female kids, two male kids, five female adults, two male adults. That should be would be the same. And we're pausing on ravens. We've probably killed more than we meant to because there was a big slaughtering spree, but uh, we definitely didn't eliminate anything because we did have those limits on. And they'll just, they will repopulate. Not worried about that. Okay, but now that's fixed. Uh, let's go to here. I'm gonna turn these, these blueprints into designations. Um, just to make sure that we still have a way through here as we build, as we build, as we do our construction. And yeah. Cool. Also had some thoughts regarding our bathhouse. Just because it's ever so muddy. Oh, flowing still? Yeah. Um, there's two things that I kind of want to change. One is relatively minor, the other is not. Uh, we'll see. We'll see what I actually do. Uh, one thought was I can make more of these little waterfall generator bits, the little plus signs. Where the water falls on top. Um, I could put some more in here. I could do like a couple along here, like up here. Um, maybe one in the middle or something. I don't know. That would be tough. No, it might not be bad actually. Hmm. Um, the main trick being that we would need to make sure. What happened to our soap? We wash in more soap? No. We're just running off with our soap. Uh, maybe you need a link set up? Because the soap gets stored here now. Right. Just not coal, not metal. Everything. Uh, so maybe the soap's in here now. Ash is here. There's some soap. I like all the granite blocks. <laughs> and all the marble. Wow. those blocks. Hi! How's it going? Um, I have a block job somewhere, surely. Quickly to the point where I wish I could search. <laughs> search in here. I'm making granite blocks for sure. Meals, jugs, coal, lignite, ore, crutches, buckets. There's a cat howling in the background. I believe that, yeah. Uh, okay. We have a lot of blocks that I don't remember telling them to make. <laughs> but that's fine. A new 
Need any more migrants. I did. I was mostly just trying to track down why these were made. Like, I don't remember telling them to make marble blocks. I think I told them to make. But, like, there's a whole bin of gabbro blocks over here. Uh, but the thing I was doing was setting our soap stockpile to take from. Going to from which he will take. You take from here. I don't think I have any specific. Um, I mean, they should only be getting work orders. Yeah, granite blocks. I mean, that's a job. I don't know. Uh, keep an eye on it. Uh, so yeah, hopefully that gets soap back into our... Who's, who's rotten? Red decompose. Rotten prepared cow brain. Someone just left their food. Okay. Uh, we have a lot of things being moved up and down, or mo moved down. I guess this is the main thing. Uh, so there's a lot of hauling jobs that aren't getting done at the moment. But we will we will get through that. Queen wants more rings and gauntlets. Making quivers. Gauntlets are here. Quivers are here. Rings will just happen. Well, that's fine. More migrants. Um, but the thing that I was examining was our bathhouse. Hoping so. Hope I just got linked up our bathhouse soap stockpile to hopefully take soap from where it's being stored, ultimately. Because um, there was soap here, and then they took it back, I guess. But, um, this is like 80% of what I wanted it. I like the little bit of water everywhere. I don't like the mud as much. Um, Mark store of equipping bolts. I haven't been paying attention to their ammo. I can't get them to wear their boots, though. I think I just need to get, uh, need to just buckle down and get more specific with their... Um, oh, they're much better now. Still the boots. Um, like you can see they all have boots assigned and they're not wearing them. I think it's because, and they're probably just not taking ammo at all. I also don't have anyone designated as a Mark Dwarf specifically. The only uniforms that I have, they're set to, like they have specific, uh, high cap. Um, it's specific armor, but they are all given permission to choose a melee weapon and a ranged weapon of their choice. So, I don't have anyone specifically designated as a Marksdorf, or even a squad designated as a Marksdorf squad. I just have two militia squads, and they are all welcome to take a melee weapon and a ranged weapon. Most of them have both. Um, ideally, they all have both, and they use the one that they prefer, basically. Um, so that at least gives weapons into their hands. Um, they'll, they can put them on their back. Um, I wonder if I can ob observe that. Um, so we have left hand is a shield, right hand is an axe. We got a quiver. Um, oh, and then the crossbow is also in the right hand. Yeah, so crossbow, X, shield. Um, I don't know how, like, in combat, I haven't really watched them in combat to see how effective that is, I guess. Um, I've definitely seen dwarves meleeing with their crossbows, which ultimately is fine. Um, 
just there's definitely instances where they'll be bashing something with their crossbow and you wish that they would just use their axe that they have in their other hand instead. Um, but I prefer that to the alternative, which is a designating Mark's dwarves and having them not grab ammo, which is probably worse. Um, or just not having a weapon at all, or uh, you designating a specific weapon and it not being a weapon that they're very good at. Uh, getting rid of creatures. All this. Working on collecting our garbage as well. Uh, let's go down here. Is that getting any better? Not really. Um, this is our, our trash pile, which I want to make bigger. Um, yeah, that's kind of where we're at and on this. So working on our gatehouse up top. Yeah, okay. This is where our granite blocks are going. Build. Oh, there's going to be walls on this floor. Uh, I'm going to select... Granite block. More tantrum. Uh, corners are important. Granite. Um, so we got these we want here. Um, but I, I have heard of people having issues with the, the ammo as well. Um, I've had, I know I've had struggles with that in previous versions as well. I can't think of what I've even done about it. Um, in previous versions, you could tell them how much of ammo. I don't know if you can get that specific with the uniforms anymore. Um, yeah, so individual choice ranged, individual choice melee. He's got a named, all three of his are named. That's ridiculous. I think maybe you've been here for a while. Um, but yeah. Um, you used to assign ammo. I'm now realizing isn't a thing. It used to be ammo was part of the uniform, um, and you could designate what kind of ammo as well. You'd say, like hunters, I want to have 100 bone bolts, and I want my soldiers to have copper bolts. You could say things like that. Um, and you could set how many. And a common issue was that the default was like 100. So you'd have... Like you wouldn't have nearly enough bolts to cover your squads uh, was a common situation that I ran into. And yeah, so you just you could like lower you could lower how much they should have and then they could figure it out. And there goes the cat. Yeah. Uh, but even then it was finicky. Militia equipment has always been bit weird. I will say that. Where'd it go? Right. Are they yep, sounds good. Have a good night. Um also, hi to France, I guess. Hi from from Seattle. Um, I'll be here. Uh, feel free to check out the VODs if you if you want to keep up. But 
I'll be here doing this. Uh, over here. Ran it. Then those all just all got made. Wow. As long as these pillars got made. the same three people. Can get rid of the floors. And you, and you. I clicked. I swear. Now we've killed all the creatures. Slowly building upward. And then up here, we're going to make more floors. That's all I need to do. And then I probably don't want wall. This is probably just gonna be a platform. Hmm. Well we'll we'll figure this out. Which means we need to start actually making the parts for our catapults. That's a fun thought. Oh. Catapults just do normal rocks, right? I don't need to make ammo for them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cat catapult. <laughs> Bug. Liaison slash children do not avoid standing in front of a firing ballista. Um...
Ooh, there is no way to prevent this from them. Emma is destroyed upon landing unless it falls to Z level. Interesting. Catapults and Ballista aim only... Hello. Aim and fire only along one Z level, while ammo from both may drop down Z levels. They do not damage the creatures there. Interesting. Well... Either are affected by fortifications. Okay, so we could have fortifications up top. Okay, well, this may not work. Um, this will probably still be... This will still be good for... Um, Um, oh, that's not what I meant. All these, okay. I'm being not paying attention. Walls, not floors. Okay. Ugh. Um, but I'm gonna I'm gonna put some catapults up top. We'll see what happens. But it sounds like they may not actually fire because they only look at their own Z level. Um, but worst case scenario, we have these as uh, spots for marks dwarves. I'm up from the fortress below, get up into this level, and shoot down at things from up here. That's the idea. I think of how I <laughs> messed this up so badly. Uh, wall, right? I said. Uh oh. Happened here. Uh, let's see. Zuthan. What have you been up to? Nish, Cyril. Zuthan. Carpenter versus militia captain. The administrator. Was this our tantruming administrator? Might have been. More, more tantrums, of course. Oh, we'll just use closest. Cool, so now I need to dig more. Tombs, tombs.
Okay. Let's do this the way I meant to. Let me. Who's leaving their little porcelain figurines around? Um, this is all getting done. Very nice. Um, but to the earlier question, I'm pretty sure catapults just fire raw rocks. Um, so I'm going to put some little stockpiles down here. This will be the ammo stockpiles for the catapults, if they actually work. There we go. At least it doesn't take long to remove those. And now the blocks are right here. Wait for this one to be done. And today. They look different because of the tile beneath them, right? There's. I think I did this right. Okay. More fighting. Interrupted by militia captain. The mandate you still want gauntlets and quivers. Still want they want a throne run, obviously. Um, okay, that's the next task. particular um let's go check on our this hooray this is going making progress here uh oh and we did that so now i'm just gonna remove that and then this we're just gonna 
channel literally one at a time. That's my solution here. Stop tantruming. Um, this is all at four. This is most. This is, I want this to be done, and then we're gonna focus all of our mining efforts on the royal quarters. Um, or even at this an hour, I feel like I've not even done anything. Anyway. This is, this is going. Marble floors. Sphalerite? Sphalerite. I don't know what that is. Okay. the blocks on one are going to be designated for the wall on the other. Oh well. Worst case scenario, if our catapult plan up on top here doesn't work, then I'm just going to put fortifications around and these will be nice little sniper nests. This is worth doing anyway, I think. There we go. Now, you. Uh, which means we should make some catapult parts. Adamanti. No, we're not doing that. Um, I want. To 12 of them. It's three per catapult. And I think we can just make them from wood. They're going to be made from wood anyway. Oh, that's fine. All catapult pl parts, please. Hi, Raven. Goodbye. I also know that there are creatures that can climb walls. I think the fact that we're... My understanding, which can always be wrong, is that the fact that we are making this out of blocks makes it harder to climb, as opposed to just raw stone. But I think there are things that can still climb. Um, that'll mostly be a matter of trying to make sure to kill them first. Um, but we'll, we're going to see. I'm, I'm curious to see how this pans out. Still going. Okay. And there you are. Done with that. Close to ban on exports. How's our gauntlets going? Surely ready to activate. Um, here. 
Jesus name. Waiting on stuff to get done. Okay. Here will be our sand stockpile. I think the glass itself will condense a bit. So this is new sandbags. Furniture. Pipe. Sandbags. Okay. Um. the type of sand isn't in here. Glass. Okay, well, let's do that, and then up here, you stop taking sand bags. That should be our only furniture stock. Well, there's all the same bags. Uh, so we'll get those moved down. And then other stockpile is uh, a. It's an output from glass furnaces. Just gonna be making glass blocks. My understanding. Materials. So it's gonna be a bar block. the other thing. I want to make clear glass. Um, mm -hmm. There's, there's going to be that. Um, and then there's green glass, clear glass, and crystal glass. There's all these different colors of sand, but the sand color doesn't actually translate into anything for the color of the glass. Um, if you let, let me, okay, um, let me get this throne room going still while I lab about that. Um, okay, cool. Oh, that's all glorious, glorious. Um, so we come down here, and I'm gonna turn on this. Yeah. And then there. We'll channel all that. Um, and then this uh, same thing. I don't want it to, sh to mine under things I'm channeling. So. Turn that on. Um, our queen needs better stuff for everything else. I was working on some of that. Uh, we got to four of each of those. New weapon rack. Four. Um, we'll, we'll make some better stuff. I have some sterling silver on order, basically. 
Um, and she, our queen likes sterling silver stuff, so I'm going to slowly replace her furniture with other materials that she likes. Um, but right now it's just, uh, she really wants to have the thing um, in some capacity. Um, oh yeah, so now we have five weapon racks and armor stands, that's good. We need a bunch more chests and cabinets. Ten chests, is that really what that said? Um... Go like... When... Sure, marble's fine. How many? You want ten chests. You have five. Uh, we'll do one. Just to make you symmetrical. And uh, not this button, that button. Need four more cabinets. Two, one. So that's your furniture taken care of. Now you just need better of everything. Yeah. Um, so that to that end, let's get smooth in. Yeah. That'll help. Start engraving it all. Making progress here. Um, oh, we also finished digging here for our outpost liaison, our other new person. Um, so you currently have those two, so you need a, a study and a dying. He's. I hope we can cram enough stuff in here, geez. Uh, if not, we'll move you somewhere else. Um, furniture. Evil, blue. Replicate what we have here. Furniture. Click. I'm clicking. No, not enclosed. Needs door. Another door. Done. And then dining room. And then you don't have these either. Uh, bedroom. And... Boom. 
These are all going to Zan. a little um that tomb is good enough well that's satisfying but you need some of everything two of everything except for three chests that's fine yeah, that's good a chest uh, yeah, we'll select, give you the good stuff, except that we don't have any. <laughs> what about cabinets? A good one. I mean, this is, marble's good. Sure. Weapon rack. Arm machine. Er, whatever. Okay. Now you just want chests and quality. Hmm. I hope those quivers happen sometime. I wonder... My leather is over here. There's no one... Quiver not made here. Quiver. Wonder our manager might be getting. Overworked a little. Um, oh, I only needed two. Can I just put that? That's it. And then uh, bronze balls. Yeah, I think our manager might be getting behind. Uh, sand's getting moved. Uh, that was the thing. Glass. Let's pull this up. So if you just use the sand, you get green glass. If you use sand and pearl ash, you get clear glass. And if you use rock clister, rock crystal and pearl ash, you get crystal glass. Um, so I want clear glass for my construction. Uh, mostly, oh, we're saving. Mostly because rock crystal will be a bit more of a difficult thing to get in the quantities that I want. Um, Pearl Ash. Oh, we make it out of Magma Kiln. Okay, that's handy. A unit of Potash and Yule, which we don't need to worry about. Let's 
So you have to... Please don't crash. Burn wood to ash, and then ash to potash, and then potash to pearl ash. Okay. Thank you for not crashing. Ultimately, that means this bar and block stockpile will also want to take ash, potash, and pearl ash. Oh boy. And currently set up to take from anywhere. So that's fine. Um, our stuff pile up here. You can also take all of those. Ash gets used for other things. Potash gets used for other things, right? Potash is fertilizer. Yeah. Um, but pearl ash is only for glass. It seems. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So that means. an ash job in here somewhere pretty poor make ash and lie okay so our ash job, let's turn this up a little. And then from ash, we need to make potash from ash. Interesting that you can also make it from lye, but ma lye is made from ash. Potash. I didn't ash tree uses either ash or lye, though lye is produced from ash. Yeah, okay. Potash requires one unit of wood and two ash. Okay. Um, yes, yeah, so we're gonna make potash from ash. And we'll say when ash is greater than 10, potash less than. And it's probably fine, um, but only make five at a time. Then after potash, I want to make clear glass. I'm just gonna call this like well let's let's start with 10. We'll we'll get a proof of concept going. We'll just do a single order of 10 clear glass blocks, see if that gets made. Um and we'll go up from there. Also need to I have so much digging to do. Look at this. 
that was the other thing I was going to do. Um, I'm going to put some tables in. And... Missed these. Fine. And then furniture. People. Over mid. Of course. No boots. What's haven't happened yet? Not twenty three. waiting on our manager to get off his butt. FL. You in jail or something? Station. That's the problem. And you're grumpy. Okay. Well, first of all, I need let's let's undo the station order because I did legitimately forget about that. Um, and I feel like I keep taking my manager out of squad, then accidentally putting him back in. You, I want to replace you. I wanted to pack store if you're already in that one. Yeah. And then I'll make sure to put Athel in one of my civilian squads. Ooh, there we go. But I don't accidentally put you in there again. Oh, that's the queen. The queen can have some training, too. Why not? Just hope that that squad doesn't get wiped out and have all of <laughs> the nobles in it or something. Um, this is all fine, because that's not anything... Where are you going? Brewer? Cleaning what? Cleaning up the goo? What goo is this? Giant ohm blood. Okay. Um, this got made. Lower. This. I'm just. Well. Whatever's closest. Um, there was also this over here. Okay, so now we have access here. Let's... We can just dig stairs down. That's... That's the smart thing. What we got. That'll help there. Now, how are we doing here? This is going. Oh, look at all that smoothing. I'd like to see that. This is, yeah, of course you have. 
Kings and Gauntlets, that's fine. Low Boots, that's fine. Because the Gauntlets one is just still there from before. That's... Now... What I was going to do over here... Put down some tables so we can actually call it a dining hall. Then I can move my food down. Two, three, four. Do something like this. You like all those tables. Um, and then furniture, chair. Well. Right, that looks fine. Uh, furniture, table. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Hold on, fish. Uh, yeah, I think this is what we're going to do. Like this. Way overkill, but that's also my aesthetic. My initial plan was to have this be like a it isn't only space. But the more I think about it, the more that I want the whole world to know about how glorious it is. Um, so this might end up just being space for literally everyone. Um, oh, the thing I'm looking, we're doing every other. Every, every third. That looks better. Um, where Kerber? People get grumpy when they have to eat without a table. Make enough tables for everyone. Right? Yep, nice and symmetrical. Chairs. Wait. Yes.
Um, so here's the start of our dining hall. Uh, let's go ahead and do the thing. Um, yeah, okay, so the open air won't work, but that's, that's fine. Um, and you'll, you'll fix that. Then I'm going to make you a location. You're going to be a new one, not a continuation of upstairs. Um, so new, new inn slash tavern, right? Yeah. that not no remove current location assignment it creates bid and the sweetness of lettuce is that Sweetness of letters. Interesting. Um, I don't suppose I can remove locations. I don't know why Bread of Smiths accidentally made that's some common area. Where the heck is this? Can I go find you? Oh, that's going to be the... That's this. Yeah, that's the Bread of Smiths. Okay. I just made these two. Okay. I think the sweetness of letters works. Um, I don't think... Cool that I can switch them. I don't think it was that easy before. Uh, see details. We'll fix all this later. Um, but if I come up here, I'm just gonna also add this. Yes? No? Is that not a thing I can do? Can I not? Hmm. Okay. Uh, I thought I thought I could. I thought I could do multi-level things. Well, what if I just do? I'll make a new dining hall. People rejected, not enclosed. Okay, <laughs> well, we have the one at least. And we'll keep going there. Getting smoothed here. You are s probably very slowly increasing value. Do I check? Now you check the value of a bedroom. What's going on here? but okay. Is this the queen? King. King is sleeping in the bed. King consort, I should say. 
I might call him an Elden Lord or something. Or Elder Lord. <laughs> I should... <laughs> Where are you? Um, now I care. Again, searching would be nice. You were right here a second ago, and I'm not going to be able to do it again. Oh, you? No, Metalsmith. Um, and you're getting moved under the furniture. I don't know why that was such a thing before. Yeah, this all got smoothed. Okay. Um... Okay. Um, I can look at the queen. Whose name began with this. You're around here somewhere. Captain, what is your name? Your name is Olan, which is like S. Queen, you, relations, husband. And I can just go straight to you. Perfect. Um, King Consort, you are Elder Lord. We are an Elder Ring. Perfect. And now stuff is happening again. We're making clear glass blocks. In theory, and is being moved. These are still getting like seriously, people. Um. Only metals, please. Everything else is fine. Yeah, that's fine. Um, how about you? Are you just are you hiding a bunch of stuff too? Well, this is where it should be going. If it's metal. Oh, that's right. Oh crap, I forgot about the... Uh oh. <laughs> oh, hey, good. Uh... Good. Getting killed on cave traps. I approve of that being a thing. I got the alert. I was like, okay, I'll just take care of these designations and go and check it out. And then I forgot about it. Um... our champion. He's run the other way. You go. Do you have a weapon? What are you doing? I'm not in the military. You're like basically naked. Yes, please run. Oh, here they come. Yeah, see, look. He was firing. And he went in. You got a bow and an axe. Both in your right hand. You have a, cop a crossbow and an axe. And one of you went into melee and one of you covered with, with shots. I mean, that's good stuff, in my opinion. Jeez. Uh-oh. Is that the champion? No. 
champion's fine. Was the other one? Uh, one of the actual squad people just got killed. The champion is fine, despite being naked. Not anymore. Uh, also captain. Well, jeez. Dig, you should run. Terry should be coming here any second now. Seriously injured. Stressed, stressed, bleeding. Seriously injured. The fact that they have to go over these weapon traps. Yes, I know. One just got through. Bug. Metal Smith. You're a dwarf. These are just a random. It's still. Armor, metalsmith, paper maker, dancer. Uh, there's a crossbowman. He's probably down here getting equipment. Yeah, okay. Please be quick about it. Everyone else is probably above. Oh, well, I don't know that for sure. That cave fish person that got in. Where'd you go? You're here. Oh, and you're being fought. Okay. Fine. Okay. Good. There's one. Another nightmare. But here we go. I think we're okay now. When we're in numbers, we are nigh unstoppable at this point. Getting one or two caught and surrounded is the problem. Okay. Uh, that means we can cancel this. Which is happening right now. So we're gonna have to pull it again. Um. Hopefully we don't accidentally launch a dwarf. Okay. Or squish a dwarf. Please don't get too close. Um, let's just... Please don't get squished. Um, are there any in here still? I'm going up. If you get squished by a bridge, I'll be upset. So I can't even get your stuff back in the case. Uh, there. We can prevent at least, right? Unless it has already been done. Mm. Just move. Here, how about if I tell you to reach over here? Okay. Do not get pulled. One, please pull it. Thank you. 
Now, I'm gonna squish a couple corpses, that's fine. Is it not? What is happening here? It's because it didn't get disconnected, did it? Excuse me, please open the door. Tell you to go in. I'm just like, no, I can't. What I'm gonna do it here, right? And from here. Hey, a caravan. Maybe we can reach here. Here goes here. Oh, we can reach. No. This is really the smallest. Okay, here we go. Let's do this. I'm going to join the two sides of our cavern lane. Do that. And then... Lower... Have just a straight shot here. Okay, well, I'll take a second. You can't get in. A giant ulm and a bunch of ant people. Ant people do want to come in on the second means. Ant people do want to show up here, but uh, second cave layer should be fine. They may just accumulate here, which is not good for FPS reasons, but uh, they're not they're not endangering us presently. Um, food. This will all be okay. I'm gonna try pulling it again. I think I just I mean. I think I want to Let's see if that helps. Oh, there was something important in there. Oh well. Okay, it has been pulled. No one is in the danger zone. There we go. Why was that so complicated? Now we can dump a bunch of corpses. More corpses. See, those haven't gotten done either. Hmm. You, you are seriously injured. Okay. 
uh, caravan. Hi, caravan. Um, how are we here? Rings and gauntlets. Low boots. Um, rings will be fine. Did gauntlets actually happen? No. But it's active. Low boots. Still active. So that should be fine. Or Captain of the Guard. Um, poet? Does a poet want to lead our guard? I don't think you are anything else. Zinnig. Zinnig Kattenkel. Um... Our champion, however, how does no one have any relevant skills? About our hammer, you can just be that. Um, our new captain of the guard needs to be put in. These mayor, this is no one. Let's be this. Do captain, captain, captain. Okay. You're just wanting two more chests. We might have now. Um, uh, here and here. And then we'll smooth the whole thing. This all got smoothed. Still waiting for people to hold the things. That's fine. Um, I'm going to check our engravers. We only have two engravers now. We have a legendary. We must have just killed a bunch. <laughs> um, six? About seven, and none of you are in the military. You are, but yeah, do that. Um, and then I'm gonna tell you to start engraving. Wait. Start. We'll do some in all of them. like this just to get started um i'm curious how quickly we can improve their value uh, but also we'll start training them up a little bit as well okay caravan broker requested move some bins now if i can find man that is all just training weapons? No. Okay, I was gonna say, that's a very valuable bin filled with wooden weapons. <laughs> with 17 grand weapons. Um, is this just worn out clothing and a single rope? Or you can take that bin. What about this one? Can't export quivers. That's cool. Um, and we can't export probably boots. Uh, hey, these are trade goods. Yeah, totems. Good. These are good. Ooh. 
cool. Um, of course, I didn't see any of that porcelain stuff up here. <laughs> and our poor stockpile is filled with uh, junk. <laughs> I'll put that lightly. Um, but let's let's do the. Um, just looking for anything that's real close. I feel like sometimes they don't get taken back down. Yeah, the porcelain is still here. Making unpassable terrain. I think so. Um, let's check this. Still waiting, but going. side of the wall. It's all you will ever see. And pearl ash. Uh, missing for a week. Oh no. Two of our named people. Uh oh. What happened? Did they get... Did I... S I don't think I squished anyone. Why wouldn't they have bodies? smaller than it used to be? That doesn't look like 3x3. Three three. You say you're active. We have wood. We have wood. 
Um, is there anywhere those would go? I assume they'd go in here. A list of parts. Catapult parts. Yeah. Bunch of tallow laying around. Uh, let's go to kitchen. Pack a tallow. Let's save that. Hundred and eight cow tallow. Very cool. Very, very cool. Okay. Let's do that. I assume tallow was also useful for cooking. Uh, I just don't want to use all of it. Uh, did any of that soap ever come down here? No. Okay. I'm um, still waiting on all of these. Yeah, we just have too many jobs going. Too many jobs, no, not enough frames. We're still at 30, uh, which is pretty good considering for the size of our fortress, I think. Um, making potash. Uh, not here, here. This should be fine. Mm, we have a bunch of miners. Carbon. Okay. Hey, even made a, a carving of rings. I'm sure she'll like that. That's really what I should do. Designed image of Snowdub seduced councils, the goblin, and distinct seers, the alligator. Distinct Sears is striking down seduced councils. About that one time, an alligator ate a goblin. That belongs on the queen's wall. Floor, I guess. Okay. Um, and then hopefully... So you're good on stuff. You just want better stuff. That got done. Okay. Cool. Where are the miners? Because they're not really here either. <laughs> hmm. Um, well, now that we have Stop it. back up to 12 grumpy people. Um, okay. And that, now we can get in from the bottom as well. If they can dig it. Um, the other part of that was uh, more digging. Um, I'm going to make little stockpiles in the dining halls. Um, and since these will be separate dining halls, I'm going to do like a little little mini stockpiles for food and drink. 
then they will pull from the main food stockpile up above. Uh, is our midpoint? Do like this. It doesn't even need to be that big. Everything stacks, so... Everything stacks very well in food stockpiles. Stop it. Um, and we'll do the same thing here. And same thing on the other side when we get to that. And those can definitely get bigger if they need to. Really just needs to be big enough for there to be like a barrel of ale and then some mugs and someone can walk in and grab it and drink it right then. They don't have to go up and yeah. I wonder if I can... What about this that wasn't working? Not even close. I mean, I know it's not. But only... Well, why did this one work? Oh, I needed to... Mm. Well, whatever. Uh, okay. This is what I want you working on. Turn down the volume of that one in particular. Okay, is it fish or ants? It's fish. Okay, well this got dug. Uh so that's that's a good thing. I want to just wall it off here. Um, okay. It's because... Why did we find this? Who's here? You're here. You are already surrounded. Oh, but you got out. Hello? Go back? Where are you going? No, that was the wrong way. The exit's up here. How can we... Ow. Fine. <laughs> that means we are replenishing our squads, unfortunately. Hmm. Dungeon Master? Miner. 
Wood burner. Yeah. Um, confident wrestler. After cooler weaver. Milker, you can beat. Legendary Mark's board. You go somewhere else. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Let's go. Um, except now I don't know who's. Oh, but it's the one not wearing. One's not wearing stuff. Now let's go down here. Legendary Mark's board. Legendary Axe Dwarf. Wow. Um, and then what about... Mm -hmm. What's some of these? What else do we have? Another Legendary Sword Dwarf here. Okay, well. I'll take it. Um, uh... Gonna need to station somewhere. Give them the order. It's half of them need to go equip themselves. Slowly filtering up. See if our people show up in time. Is that away? Yeah, okay, here they come. Not alone, you naked because you're just brand new, aren't you? Where are you going to? What are you looking for? You're gonna go in there to grab a thing, and get yourself murdered and naked, aren't you? <laughs> Did you really just? Did you really just? Logan. Which one were you? Legendary Observer. Okay, so you weren't one of the good ones. One of the legendary ones. You decided to go behind enemy lines to pick up your equipment, first thing. Saw one cave fish person, jumped into the water, and now you're drowning. Not a lot I can do to help you there.
Blub blub. Okay. Here they come. Nice little choke point going. Go down here. You're now you're just wandering off. Those injuries. Be gone, fear. I guess I, sh I shouldn't say you jumped in a lake. You probably got pushed into a lake. But still. No, oh, people. God. Y'all. Y'all are killing me. Uh, let's do... Okay, let's reposition our station order down here, since that's where we're going anyway. You doing? I said I'm in tomb. Oh, you're going for. Yeah, okay. Yeah, you died, didn't you? You aren't going to be any better. Accomplished Hammerdorf. run down here just to make sure there's nothing else hiding. Um, geez. I, I was just gonna do the whole thing. I wanna just like build a ramp out or something. How do I save you? You're already dead. <laughs> All that steel is just sitting there. Well. I want to smooth those. So that's fine. There's this one down here. Yeah. Waiting. Um, okay, well, this is all getting there. My God. Okay. Um, we're going to come over here, just make sure there's nothing left. Yeah, I think we're fine. Why were these? Mm, those are probably the ones that were. Where are you, dwarfs? Weapon Smith, no. Wood burner, sure.
Oh, jeez. Armor. Four. Uh-oh. <laughs> that, that's weird. Um, that's all from before. Oh, barons, visiting barons. Okay. Problematic seat. Okay, okay, okay. That's gonna be fine. God. Okay. We're getting there. Slowly but surely. Going somewhere. Uh, fish dissector. Continue dabbling. Okay, so all that got engraved. Now you don't engrave underneath things, though. You get the walls. Okay, you engrave under stuff just not under the they want better everything tomb dining hall bedroom um i should have engraved all of this before The royal dining room, royal mausoleum, royal bedroom. It's all the same. Uh, this. I'll just. Is your tomb? Your tomb also needs to be. Fine. start with that. It'll be fancy eventually. Okay, here we go. Uh oh. It's a duck in a tree. With a baroness. Is this... How long have you been there? People... No activity! See, this is the problem, is that now they're gonna start thinking they can just be down here. Even though all of this is forbidden. I have no combat logs about that. What are you doing? Fairness of grizzle orbs. You're a visitor, so I can't even, like... 
felt self-pity after being unoccupied too long, so you jumped in a lake. Yeah, of course you are. And they're like... Just swimming? They're just going for a swim. Barons are swimming in a lake. Found a body. I guess that's what happened. Um, okay. So I'm gonna carve fortifications here. Uh, yeah. No, that's tracks. There. Uh, we'll do that. This can all stay forbidden. Forbid the lake stuff, or did I unforbid everything? It's still forbidden. Just careful with those. I don't know what this means. I don't know why they're just going missing. I don't know how we lost track of them. These. That's cool. Hungry. Yeah, I guess that's fair. Why is it? No, oh, that was probably a. It was a fight. Adil? Yeah. I don't usually have such a hard time keeping everyone from killing each other. Like, being happy is one thing, but... They're just murdering each other. You have waterfalls, what more do you want? Okay. Ban on exports. Um, we're good on those, that's good. We're coming along. Now we're down to our last floor of our throne room. I'm going to turn all this on. And then probably also just turn it into number one priority. So I'll just channel, all right. I can... Designate it as a room before we get our glass floor set up. I think I'll just like poke holes and replace them with glass as we go. want to engrave a bunch, though I guess if the stuff above won't count towards the room's value. Can you, en you can't engrave a slope, can you? Let's see. If 
ไปนอ maybe you could okay maybe we'll be fine kind of tempted to leave the slopes because that's kind of a cool look but I could also just make it stepped and just put carvings and statues and such up along the walls Uh, someone's coming. And we'll have this last level. Visiting Peddler. I never raided. Oh, they're still here. Goodness. I guess things are moving slow if they're still here. Um, okay. Bars. I I guess I care about tin. Mine as well. Oh, and sterling silver. Gems are expensive to buy that way. Rough gems. I need stones. Chains. The outer lanes. Those are expensive. in particular. Steel meaner. Meaner neener. Um, uh, well, let's be a little pickier. Need to, like, make some. Because the cheesies are expensive. Anything that I can make out of, like, Silver. Ninety six. Those are good. Those are good. Wall. I mean, I have fifteen K worth of bells. <laughs> There's some porcelain in there. Jeez. Are cool. I don't, what do toy boats are? Toys in general are good. Not for mini forge. Or yak. Aka. Or yak. Turkey gobbler. Is exit. Making my own weapons, thank you. And armor. Oh, and sand. Sand. 
he's fine. Um, and I think we're good on leather and such. And a little neat. Um, any cool books? That won't go in my library. Mm, a lot of cheese. Wow. Common sense breathing. Stay out of water. Start your day with breathing. Wind patterns. My only mistake. The moving sun after the end. Now, the fact that we can't export the rings is cool. There must be an artifact in here or something. Keep an eye out. Yeah. Named ring. Uh, these are all fine. Maybe we need to keep our rings separate. But we can probably just assume that she will always have an order to not export rings. Muscle shell ring. Okay. Have enough when not counting artifacts and rings. Could be a porcelain thing in here somewhere. They're just totems. Cool. Of stuff. Fire fine. Yeah, this is all the all the all the clothing that I want to get rid of. Very cool. Oh, but the where's the porcelain one? It was that one. It was worth so much because it had an artifact in it. Okay. Uh, we're trading 6k. Hi, cat. Uh, so we'll just not do the books and we can be a little more picky about the instruments. Happy with that. Okay. The freighter. Okay. Ten minutes left in a little allotment for the day. Can we can we finish this? That'd be cool. I'll just leave it unpaused and let them dig. Cave Toad. Hmm. 
I'm right as they were gonna leave. Perfect. deal with those ant people down there for FPS reasons. Fortunately. Um, so we got grand. Okay. With some migrants. Jeez. Oh, you're the capital, after all. There you detailed under. Really confused. And then that redesignated those. Hmm. Do you have a chair in here? I don't know if you have a chair in there. The Pillar of Fame. Engraved on the floor is a well-designed image of two bryolite... bryolite cut gems? So, okay. The Drink of Skirts. An image of Lolor Oilchaft, the dwarf, and Anguish Flares, the cavefish woman. Anguish Flares is striking down Lolor Oilchaft. Yeah, in mid spring of 110. Yeah, we there's probably a couple cave fish person kills dwarf events that you can uh, make some carvings about. The anger of stabbing. An image of Ava's brass princes, the dwarf and dwarves. Dwarves are refusing Ava's. Ava's is making a plaintive gesture. The artwork relates to the removal of the dwarf Ava's from the position of bookkeeper. <laughs> in this late summer of 106. Uh, yeah, that was a thing I did. Uh, a bookkeeper was... Uh... Oh, yeah, you're finally dead, aren't you? Oh. F. F to Ule. Um, I hope you're, they were getting fed, and that wasn't a, um... I hope that wasn't preventable on my part. Uh, more more royalties visiting. The main reason I'm thinking that our nice fancy area down here is gonna be open to to everyone is so that all these visiting like barons and stuff can see all our fancy stuff. They can go home and tell everyone about how fancy we are. Look at this. We can even look at it. Look, view it from down here. Um, yeah, we're gonna have a nice little mini pyramid section. Fairness of clasp charm. Uh, what else is getting carved? The Quiet Confederations. Exceptionally designed image of a date palm. The oily present. Um, an image of stacked cl climate rims. The dwarf and dwarves. Stacked is surrounded by the dwarves. The arc relates to the appointment of the dwarf stacked to the position of military captain. Snarling winnower. Image of entrance brave the balance of matches. The fungi wood mini forge that the goblins came to come in demand. Amazing. We still have it somewhere. Uh, Mast is an exceptional rendition of the Brim of Rax, a masterfully de designed image of a goblet. Image is the symbol of the dip ceiling. So our our government, right? Is yeah, civilization. Okay, our civilization symbol is a goblet. Good to know. This carbon's going quick. 
The lunch cover of Brides? The heck is a lunch cover? Uh, an exceptionally designed image of Tobol Tower Bears, the dwarf. Tobol Tower Bears is laughing. The artwork relates to the insanity of the dwarf Tobol Tower Bears after failing to create an artifact in Elder Ring in the early autumn of 105. Oops. That was <laughs> one of our early, earlier, 105, uh, earlier failed strange moods. Immortalized forever on the queen's bedroom floor. Three more quivers. So got made, I assume. Well, potash is being made. These are, whoops. These are just a one time, right? Yeah. We haven't actually successfully made... Oh, we're making potash. We're not making pearl ash. Easy. Uh, mm. No. Potash, then pearl ash, then glass. Pearl Ash is going to be... Monthly... If... Pearl Ash is less than 10, sure. Potash greater than... Uh... We'll see if that fixes that. Oh, what else? The Frenzy of Perishing. Masterfully designed image relates to the destruction of the history of the forest retreat in Elder Ring. Destruction of the history of the forest retreat. Someone destroyed a book. Oh, well, speaking of fey moods. The Sorcerer of Soothing. An image of Itha Ponderflaxen, the elf, and Loloma Flightrung, the elf. Loloma is striking down Itha. The artwork relates to the killing of the elf in the weathered swamps in the late summer of 105, the Assault of Thunder. The Amethyst Emerald. I guess emeralds can actually be a lot of different colors, so that kind of Kind of makes sense, even though being worded very strangely. An image of Barrow's dead budded, the deity of rebirth and death. Dead budded is a very good name for a death and rebirth name. Uh, depicted as a rotting female dwarf and weeping. Terrifying. Enjoy your bedroom, queen. <laughs> the gale of conflict. Uh, an image of Litast Myth Towns, the dwarf. Litast is striking a menacing pose. The artwork relates to the return of the dwarf Litast from the dead as a restless haunt in Elder Ring in the early winter of 102. <laughs> the Shanks of Scintillating. Masterfully designed image of Neguzlu Lie Slit, the goblin. And class praises the big. Giant alligator. Clasp praises the big is striking down the Glusu. This is another. It's a different alligator killing a different goblin in a different room. <laughs> the paint of routing. Masterfully designed image of a high wood. The image is the symbol of the contingent seals, a local dwarven government. 
Yeah, because, uh... No, not the hat. Our civilization is the dip ceiling, but our site government is the contingent seals. So she got the symbols for our main government, our entire kingdom, or if that's what we call it, and our site government are both engraved on our walls here. Um, that's all cool. I need pearl ash, I know. More barons. Need a clothes shop. You good? Yeah. Okay. Going for it. Need more space for refuse. We're getting too much stinky stuff. I don't want to have to haul everything up and then down. But I feel like it's just getting... Even this stuff. Is it... Is still a zone? Yes. Clean, construct, drink, eat, dump. So someone's dumping. What are you hauling? A bone. Here's going straight all the way down. Okay. So things can be dumped here. I guess they're slowly doing it. Maybe this should be... This should be next. After the dining hall? Yay, look at all this. Perfect. Oh, my truck. Mostly granite. Okay. Now. I'm gonna remove the little bumpy bits. Uh, what did that punch through? Interesting. Um, I might make a wall there just to close it off for the moment. Uh, can I build there? I... Hello. How's it going? I have a throne room. At least most of one. Oh. <laughs> no worries. Um, noticing something on my stream? How is... Why is... All... Has my chat always been showing up on my webcam also? Actually, I think I know when I did that. Um, I'm doing okay. I am 
I'm going to put a throne in this throne room. Um, you're just going to be straight in the middle. Why not? Give you a nice marble one. And now, this can be a throne room. Which is also an office. Just... Okay. Well, that was interesting. Uh, we'll close that off. But that will be fine. Done. And then we assign this to our queen. Which means now you have... Oh, and we're even... Okay, perfect. I think throne room is just what you call an office that's fancy enough. Um, because they're just both rooms with chairs as their primary operative ingredient, I guess. Um, so like if you if you carve out a little closet with a chair, you can call it an office. And then if it gets big enough, then it becomes a throne room. Because um, our, our outpost liaison wants a throne room as well. Um, yeah, throne room. Uh, Queen needs a royal throne room. Uh, but like Duke needs... Uh, well, he needs op opulent throne room. And Mayor needs a decent study. Those are all the same room, just at different qualities, basically. It's true. Um, and they'll even do meetings in here. I think. I mean, meetings will happen wherever the queen is. That's what my thought was. I'm going to go over here my trash pile there are there's okay oh, i told someone to have the wheelbarrow that's the thing to not do hmm. i wish we just have so much garbage we have so many corpses and so much junk that we're really backlogged on uh labor because of it uh, but look at this, we've, en we've engraved all this stuff. Uh, mandated construction, you want more quivers. Oh, we have so many quivers, dude. I've used all my leather on quivers. I was just going through and reading some of the uh, engravings that we've put on our queen's stuff. Those were usually entertaining. Um, while we get it all dug out. Uh, image of Iga's Phantom Blinds the Ren Woman. Iga's Phantom Blinds is laboring. The artwork relates to the settling of the Ren Woman in the Weathered Swamps in 31. Interesting. This is a, a historical figure, Ren Woman, who settled into a place, and that's an event that happened. That's cool. Masterfully designed image of a goblet. A couple of, we've had a couple of those. Um, the goblet is the symbol of our parent civilization. The dip ceiling is us. Um, so there's a couple of, uh, of those. Here's our king. Um, our our king is is he's a king consort. Our queen is our actual monarch. So I renamed him as Elder Lord because we're in the fortress of Elder Ring. Um, yeah, I don't know. They just kind of name them. The name doesn't always seem to relate to the theater of Omen. Finally designed image of Nako Hell Lauded the Goblin and Zerko. Dune Sage, the human. Zerko is striking down Nako. The artwork relates to the killing of the goblin Nako by the human Zerko in combined horror in the Weathered Swamps. A lot of stuff has happened in the Weathered Swamps. Where is the Weathered Swamps? The Weathered Swamps. It's here. Are we in the Weathered Swamps? We're in the Weathered Swamps. This is all the Weathered Swamps. Holy cow. The Weathered Swamps is huge. 
this whole freaking continent. Flayed continents is all... Everything's the flayed continent. Well, no, not everything. This whole northern landmass is the flayed continents. This whole section is the weathered swamps. No wonder a lot of events have happened there. It is so, all their names are always so good. It crossed Iden fast rendition of the Brim of Racks, a masterfully designed. Okay, the Brim of Racks. Are they all ancient rabbit? The final dusk. An image of a bronze, a named bronze shield. The Pelts of Meditation. Image of Imimi Diamond Howl, the elf, and Omo Ivy Whipped, the elf. Omo is striking down Imimi. Artwork relates to the killing of the elf by the elf and the weather swamps in the late autumn of 106. The Singed Attack. Okay. Someone began their thing. That's good. Need to grab Moonstones. Okay. Working on making glass. <laughs> I can still be. Um, looking back down here. So we finished digging out our throne room. Um, now the trick. Do I actually have any glass yet? I've been trying to make glass. It's a whole process, though. Um, I'm making blocks of glass. Not yet. I think we're probably waiting on... Oh, tell me. Mm -hmm. Clear glass blocks. You are active. Pearl ash. Pearl ash comes from here. And the clay crafts are just going to go forever. Mm. A lot of things have similar wound, hole in stomach. Uh-huh. I assume there's a connection with some of them, at least. Oh, artifact. Created miss missile no, oh, I'm not even gonna try. Miss Mishthum Thakrish. Mishram Thakrish. Early pigtail skirt. It's a legendary skirt! Artifact skirt. Probably spins real good. The scholarly blazes. Now, I notice America has the same moon. That's true. That's an interesting thought. Uh, let's see. Encrusted with briarlight cut moonstones, encircled with bands of pigtail, rectangular moonstone, cabochons, and bronze. Made from pigtail cloth, menaces with spikes of pigtail and cowbone. Image of round, brilliant cut trims and naked multi leather. This is a cloth skirt encrusted with moonstones and bronze and bone. Oh, the fact that it's clothing means we have to display it. Because if someone wears it and wears it out, then that's bad. Um, okay, well, we can use that opportunity to do... Um, this is going to be our new artifact space. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and put down, if I have any displays. Need the display object. Okay, make me some display objects. Um, You can make display cases also, but that's also glass, and I, I want to save my glass for the floor first. Um, but we can make these out of marble. Marble. Uh, make, like, 20 to start with. Your tomb's already excellent. Okay, so now you just care about the quality of the throne room. Um, and our... This person also wants some engravings. Can do that now. Not these? Wait, yeah. No, those are, hold on, those are fortifications. Undo that real quick. That would be sad. Need to engrave. Thank you very much. There we go. It's probably good enough for you. Um, and we probably need the... Clusters, spider. So many barons! Holy cow! Uh, rock coffins, wooden doors. I want. I want you to finish some glass. Stop with the mandates. More loads. Surprise! Okay. Is anyone making me pearl ash? Please make me pearl ash. Look at all that. Oh my goodness. We just have too much stuff. We can't move it around fast enough. Um, okay, this is finally starting to, to move. Good. Um, yeah, good, 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 good. Here, yeah. Okay, so that's that's a positive thing that was being held up for quite a while. Um, and then we are also digging here. Oh my goodness, look. Okay. Our dining hall. Uh, when, I'm going to call this a priority just so that we can get it done. And we're just going to mine out here. Yeah. Get okay, rid of the slopes. And there, we have our stockpiles for food. Um, I'm going to do this real quick. And... You are a food stockpile. Only accepts prepared meals. 
You are a food stockpile. Only accepts drink. Mead. Bumblebee mead and mead. <laughs> um, okay. Right, and then you are just it's just prepared meals. There's no category. So then I want you to take here. And then you take also from here. Which means Or even socializing. Her last name is Starluster? That's cool. One should not complain or betray any feeling. Ooh, I also want to get rid of these. <laughs> stairs even uh, and then a door can go here I'm going quicker now I also want to remove all of the ring. These, then all of want to see this digging project be complete, and then we will have completed two major digging projects today. Throne room and first half of the dining hall. This will be plenty for, for now. This The second half, I'm going to mirror the whole thing down here, and that's just egregious. This is like way overkill anyway. Um, we have the giant dance hall. We have the dining hall balcony above. And then we have just a bunch of open air. And then we have a smaller dining hall up above that. Um, but currently it's just a dining hall. Oh, look, they're already populating it with wine, uh, prepared food barrels, wine roast. Cool. Mountain goat sweet bed roast, chopped liver roast. Cool. Yeah, totally. Not to our fortress unless you're going way overboard. Uh, nope. That's all fine. And then here. And good on ramps here. Excellent. It's all mica. Lots of mica, marble, hematite. Perfect. Galena. Cool. 
Oh, petitions. Sure. It's been a while since I've had a petition. Uh, still begging for Pearl Ash. Have we made any glass block? We've made one glass block. Okay. Uh, so let's... I want to install one glass block and make sure that it's all going to work the way I think it does. Bring a pantrum. Just poke a hole in there. And this got done too. Strip ball. That will all get redone afterwards, but that's going to be a longer term thing. Just want to close that off. Oh, look. Golden barrel clusters. The tree cluster. Oh, there's the cassid, right? Okay. <laughs> Amber opal. Okay, you punched a hole. Now, construct for me a floor made of clear glass? No. Hmm. Might just be sitting in the workshop still. Your glass block. Okay. Clear glass block. Perfect. I've seen I've seen what it looks like. I don't think we get to look like we won't see what's below. It will just look like kind of an opaque glass floor, but thematically we will know what's going on. Then I believe we can also carve the glass. And that's really where the value is going to come. Clear glass on its own is a pretty valuable, moderately valuable thing. Two clear glass. Where is it? It doesn't say. Mm -hmm. oh, here. Uh, clear glass is worth five. Cool. Okay. Now we're nice and sealed. Perfect. Needs pearl ash. That's yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we doing it? We're doing it. There. First tile of glass. But yeah, it'll it'll just look like that. Uh, clear glass block floor. And right beneath it is like three floors of, of space. Um, and then I believe I don't even need to smooth it, do I? Can I just engrave it? I can just engrave it. Um, would it let me smooth it? No, it's just automatically smooth. That's cool. Um, yeah, cool. I'll, I'll wait to engrave, I guess. We're gonna need to do this in volume. Uh, I got... One, two, three, four, five... 
X. And really, it's like one, two, three, four, six, seven, nine, and twelve. But twelve by twelve, kind of. Um, no, it is. So that's one hundred and forty-four glass blocks, All right? Not the worst. It'll take a bit, though. Um, but anyway, what else is going on? More dukes. So many dukes. Um, our outpost liaison is like almost happy too. Come over here. Yeah. Great. There's our dining hall. And we'll just remove these. And that. Or... Oh, and chests. You need chests in here so that they can store their mugs. Furniture chest. Do. Uh, not a little bit. I think I'm going to end here, but we've finished our dining hall, or at least we finished digging it out. We put a bunch of marble tables in there, or a bunch of marble chairs. Just good tables. Yeah, cool. Um, we have a functioning dining hall. What was it? It was called something funny. Oh, now we're saving. Tell you in a second. We finished digging out our dining hall. This will be our new dining hall. I'm probably just going to decommission the one upstairs um, and then also decommission the, the food stockpiles up there so that all the food is brought down here um, or at least in the parent stockpile up there, uh, which is not too far from here. Uh, we finished digging our throne room. We satisfied our queen as far as her other three rooms go. Just need to make the throne room fancier, which will happen with the glass floors. We've started making glass. It's going to take a minute just because pearl ash is going to be a pain. going to burn a lot of trees for this. Um, that's really what makes the throne room extra special, is that it will be built with Elf tears. <laughs> We're going to have to burn a bunch of trees in order to make this much clear glass. Um, that's what makes it dwarfy. But yeah, we're going to have a big old glass floor. We're going to engrave it, and then uh, it'll be worth a whole bunch. I don't think just engraving that floor, we will have a pretty easy time. Uh, but yeah, okay. Have a pretty easy time making the throne room worth what we needed to make it worth because uh, the the material that you make something out of is just is a multiplier but for the end value so the fact like a you engrave a piece of stone it's like the value of the carving times the value of the stone stone's worth one good stone like marble's worth two and that glass is gonna be worth five um, so it's going to accumulate in value very quickly. Um, just looking out just a little bit. Our architecture, we're sitting at, looks like 200,000 value. Cool. Um, oh look, they're even... This. Eat. 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 Socialize. Eat. Here they come. Oh. Okay. And then, are you wanting? You're wanting. You're wanting food. The food's right here. Oh, should I? That's what I should do. This. Uh. No. All visitors welcome. No. This button. Uh, we're gonna add. 
the stockpiles to the thing itself. Then the rest of that is fine. That that allow you to go find food. You were storing. Taking. <laughs> okay, fine. What are you doing? You are constructing. What you're putting in the chest. You're all putting in some mugs. Cool. Are you actually eating? Do you have food? No? Rook lamprey. Okay, you're eating a lamprey. That's cool, I guess. Be cool if you ate the prepared food that I had sitting here for you, but you can also just eat a raw eel. You do you. What are you eating? I don't want to look at and fish. Mm. Okay, we'll see if we can get them to actually eat the prepared food, because that's higher quality food is more happy thoughts, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, you want rings. Rings will happen. Look at all, all the screen. I still have no idea what a messenger does. Maybe I should have a messenger. Let's just find someone. Wax worker. <laughs> I have no idea what that'll do. Um, okay. Oh, and the other thing is that I guess I want to make sure. But it appears that these areas can't span more than one floor. Yeah. Okay. So. Oh, but we could make a different area and assign it to the same. That's what we do. Okay. So meeting area. This is a dining hall. This is a meeting area. Right. I'll just do that. Accept. And then we're going to add this to the same. I believe it was this one, the sweetness of letters. Uh, transform common area. Hmm. Should be much bigger. That. Oh. Now. Ah, 40 by 26. That's a big... Does that seem right? That seems about right. Big old dance hall. Now people can just socialize all they want, organize their big old dances. We'll, we'll see if we can get it, get it going, but uh, they can organize these dances where they actually move around and you can see them like spin around. They can make big ones. Um, and it's kind of dependent on how big of a space they have. So now they have a big old space. Um, so we look here, right, and here. Well, you just grabbed, you're hungry, you're eating, you're hauling, a prepared meal. And where are you going to go? You're going to eat it here? You're going to eat it right there. Perfect. That's what I like to see. Um, so then that means I can do the same thing up here. I'm going to do another, um, I guess this is a dining hall. Uh, not enclosed. I'll, I'll keep playing with that. Um, you... This place is different. I'm just going to, we'll do that. No, I want you to remove that. Okay. 
I'm gonna stop here because I keep just getting myself distracted. And what is left? Alpaca meat on the mug chest. Filthy creatures. Uh, but yeah, uh, let's go up here, and I'm just gonna straight up, uh, I mean, I still want my, my, my inn, let's do, I don't know, yeah, basically, uh, see, the dance floor in here is 14 by 16. Now, I could remove the zone. That leaves our, our inn. This is it still... No, now these are just bedrooms. Are these just bedrooms? I meant for these to be here. Can we... It is the Devourer of Merchants. Dance floor none. Rented room 17 out of 20. Okay. Cool. So now the Devourer of Merchants is strictly a inn, I guess. Um, I'll be moving that downstairs too at some point. Uh, but this, here's all the food. I don't want the food up here anymore. Um, I'm going to leave the stockpile because I don't want stuff to rot. Or rot if it's not in a stockpile. I'll remove the building so we're not making more stuff up here. I have all this replicated downstairs. I think just moving this down will help with our workflow just because more stuff will be closer downstairs. Um, it's my favorite inn name. The Devourer of Merchants is perfect. I wish I could claim that I did that on purpose, but that's just... That's just the way the dice roll sometimes. It's like, oh, that would be, couldn't be perfect. Um, so this stockpile is theoretically... No? Um, I want you to give... to here. Alright. Who's to give? So we'll, we'll stop producing up there. We will start giving to down here. And then all of our food will be down here. The rest of this looks pretty okay. We still have worn out clothing just everywhere. Don't know exactly how to fix that yet. Um, but yeah, we're even like, we're processing all our plants here. Perfect. We're making meals? No. Probably fine on meals. Furnace. Oh, the for the worn out clothes. Um, I've been trading those. Oh, look at okay. They're finally clearing all this stuff out. So we'll let's put two polarers on there. Give it the old double tug. The worn out clothing I have discovered, or I learned on the wiki, um, is that you can trade it. Um, it loses value as it loses durability, essentially, but you can still do it. Like, they will stop wearing stuff that's lost 75% of its durability. You can still trade it for 25% of its worth, and now it's money, and you've gotten rid of the item. So that's what I've been doing. I've, I've, I've traded away a couple bins of, of worn-out clothing at this point, so that's worked out nicely. Uh, okay, so I'm going to stop recapping what I've done and actually stop the day. <laughs> um, look at this, the, the Royal Quarters. We have we have made great progress. Um, you can even see, there was a time back, uh, yes, um, there was a time in Door Fortress where you couldn't see multiple levels like this. You would see the level that you're looking at, and then like this empty space would be black. And you would come down and I, you would just see this ring that was just on this level and the ring, and then you'd come down here and you'd see the floor. The fact that we can be up here, and you know, we can see all the way down, and we can see the throne 
down at the bottom of the throne wheel throne room in this nice big well area and we're gonna see the glass floor underneath I'm, I'm very happy with that so uh, let's Oh, snatchers. More fighting. Okay. Well then, save and return. Mordor Fortress on Monday. More Elden Ring on Saturday. More of the same. Yeah. Bye, cat. <laughs> okay. Uh, I feel like I've already done all of my recapping and stuff. So I'm just going to be done. Um, have a good weekend. Have a good rest of your week. Goodbye.